So hi guys, uh, we have received a message. Backup failed and what's next? How can I fix it? Please help me do. So most of the messages we see from our friends or students, people who work in the live environment, they get panic and then they'll find out a way how to fix it. So these are the WhatsApp messages we used to get, but still, how we'll fix it? What kind of errors we face, or where do you find this backup failed? How do we trace this failed error? What kind of backups fails? What reason the backup failed? Let's see in this session. So. I have a database on this box and uh, let's verify instance up and running. You can see a prod instance is up and running on this box. Do you have any backups scheduled on the cron tab? Because I can see a backup job scheduled at uh, 1 am, 8 minutes. You can see from the cron tab if and yell the backup job was scheduled the shell script be inviting into a log file the information you can trace the errors from this log file so this log file will help you trace the errors so we, as we have a question why the backup fails What reasons? What circumstances? The backup fails. What made a backup failed? There are many circumstances, there are many reasons, of course. We used to find uh, frequent backup failures, but a lot of factors are there. One is a uh, disk space. If you don't have enough space, you can find out from DFF and H. The disk usage, the back, the backup partition. If you are going to hold your backups on your horror backup, might be filled, hundred percent. There's no space on your disk to locate your backup. One could be the reason is disk space, or someone commented the backup in your front app job due to some maintenance in some maintenance they have commented the job and they forgot to uncomment that job you can use a hash in the cron top job to comment it there is a maintenance and uh, we need to comment it but once the maintenance completed we need to uncomment as well as so this is one of the circumstances the backup job not run at that moment. So the next day we get an error. Backup failed, no backup found. So the output is backup failed, no backups found. So make sure maintenance, once the maintenance completed, uncommented. Due to archlog file system fill, someone removed the archives. But still, the backup failed. As the backup failed due to the archlog not found. So, this is one other reason the backup fails. So, still. Never remove the arc locks. Never remove manually with rm command unix rm command arc lock files. Have a backup, remove it. So that is one of the circumstances. Even 
or someone removed the script even backup script or your instance is down or could not available the instance is down Carmen backup failed due to the instance is down or the listener is down because the backup job was configured with the TNS names net service name so failed that could be one of the reason or the mount point went into read only mode catch up your system engineer because it's in read only mode you cannot write the backups the backup failed even mount point the aura backup example or you have backups this mount point is dismounted one could be the reason these many circumstances the backup fails or many there are many if i speak much more on this but still as a dba what action how do you trace first then how what kind of action and what are the preventive measures we need to have the same issue is being repeating then what is the permanent solution will you give a temporary solution or permanent So ensure that even if you find some less time, but give a permanent solution, never give a temporary solution and close the ticket. Most of the DBS does the giving a temporary solution and just they will close the ticket. It's not a good idea. Find out a permanent solution. Even if you fix that with the temporary solution, never close the ticket, keep track with the ticket. And find some time later. Update the note that you have given temporary solution as of now and being still working on it, then give a permanent solution for it. But still, how we trace on this? So we have a log file. Using a log file, we can trace. Every cron tab job has a log file. We can trace that. We can find out the location from the cron tab FNL. Let's see on this mission. So you can find out your cron tab F and L. Listing your jobs. This is an example, of course. The Arman level one is being redirecting the output into your log file. So this is the log file. It's located under aura backup prod logs. So go to that location and check your log files. So from logs folder, you can see our log files. One of the log files found the latest at 124. And we can read this log file using Unix tail command. Let's run the tail command on this particular log file. You can read the log file, find or to trace errors whether it's successfully completed or terminated i can see rman 03002 arc log was missing the particular arc log 106 was missing here and the linux error says that no such file or directory and the rman prompt ended at this moment now we have traced the error. Now what the action to be taken? We have traced from the log file found uh, from your aura backup location. 
see this is as per my environment but in case in your environment it could be different location you can find it from your front app fndl so as your new dba even if you are new dba to the company and you have joined and there is no knowledge transfer no worries just with the root password you should be able to track every location of your cron jobs data files instances databases on the server so let's trace this your location as well as and your log files your scripts location your backup location even r1 backup jobs you can find out even the configuration of your r1 and connect to that particular instance and get configuration so with the root password just with the root password we don't need any knowledge transfer from any dba only just need the server and the passwords for the root user and keep track every server how much what all the necessary configurations have been did the baselines uh, have a baselines for once handover then on top of that you can have your recommendations suggestions and fixes so now what the action to be taken as our clock file was lost one use cross check command this will validate all the arc logs physically exist if not it will mark as expired second then have a full backup for a consistency backup full consistency backup because as arc log was missing recovery will not be consistency so to have a consistency to maintain a consistency till you have a full backup better have immediately the full backup it's not a just a temporary solution fix it but the recovery may fail let's have a full consistency backup as well as so let's go with cross check command connect your arman target slash and use cross check arclog all is going to validate been validated 54 objects as a failed out of that one file was failed it validated 54 objects it including 130 it's a 56 object it says but one of the file was found lost can see above we can trace the output even then let's go ahead with full backup insert the full backup what are the backup from your cron tab you have or level 0 backup backup incremental level 0 database so it creates a consistency always have a full backup okay guys uh, the issue got fixed now and this will help you might be many other circumstances i can discuss a lot still a few suggestions and recommendations being given guiding you which we received one of the error okay done guys you can comment us in case you find some other issues we can give you glad with a lot of solutions on this Okay guys thank you